Deep in the Mato Grosso jungles of Brazil, Captain Claymore of G.I. Joe leads four other members of this elite force. They are Wetsuit, Leatherneck, Dial Tone, and Mainframe. Their mission is to retrieve a downed informational satellite lost somewhere in this dark, savage land before Cobra can get their reptilian hands on it. The security of America depends on it. All right, men, listen up. This new Voltronic Gala hitter indicates that SATCOM is nearby. Does it indicate a range? Probably a few clicks up this jungle path, wetsuit. And dollars to donuts, Cobra is too, so look sharp. Captain Claymore, sir? Yes, Style Tone? Now, why would Cobra want to knock our satellite out of the sky anyway? SATCOM is our eye in the sky. Every day it receives thousands of pieces of information and numerous intelligence reports from around the world. If Cobra gets a hold of it, they could drive us to our knees. Then, uh, what are we waiting for? You're wasting time if you're waiting on me. All right, let's move out. Yo, Joe! Meanwhile, not far away, in another part of the jungle, Cobra Commander, along with Destro and the Baroness, leads his vipers toward the down satellite. According to our sources, the G.I. Joe satellite has fallen very near here. And what about G.I. Joe? I've arranged a small reception committee for them. <laughs> yes, Destro, darling. G.I. Joe will be the guest of honor at the local native's nocturnal banquet. Oh, I see. <laughs> now, let's get that satellite. Cobra! Cobra! Unbeknownst to Captain Claymore, Cobra Commander has engaged a local tribe of savage natives to keep G.I. Joe at bay. What's that? The rocks in your head. Those are the drums of the Tupiguadni tribe, and they're aware of our presence. If we don't find that satellite by nightfall, we are in big trouble. What kind of trouble? You don't want to know, soldier. There it is, Captain Claymore. The satellite. And there's Cobra. They've spotted us. Come on. Cobra! So much for a walk in the park. Yo, Joe! For three long hours, G.I. Joe battled the Cobra Commander and his band of vipers. Twilight time is now approaching. Soon, it will not be safe for either parties to remain in the jungle. Cobra Commander! The sun is setting! We must get out of here! Yes, Commander. Even we can become victims to the horrors of the Tupiguarni. Let G.I. Joe have their precious satellite while we still have our lives. Cowards! I'm surrounded by sleeping, simpering cowards! On the other hand, we could always come back another time! Yes, Cobra Commander! Perhaps 
another time would be a splendid idea. Now, please, Cobra Commander, advise the Vipers of your new strategy. Cobra, retreat! Cobra Commander, Destro, Baroness, and the Vipers retreated back to the safety of their mores and fled down the river to the nearest port. Meanwhile, Captain Claymore has little time to get his men and the satellite out of the jungle before the sun sets. Dial tone, radio us a tomahawk. We're getting ourselves and that satellite out of here. Yes, sir. Base, there's a G.I. Joe. Send us a chopper. What's it? Leatherneck, secure that satellite for transport. Yes, yes sir. sir. Mainframe, keep a sharp eye. We only have a few minutes of daylight left. You got it, Captain. The seconds tick away as the sun merges with the horizon. It casts a golden glow along the jungle ceiling. Time is running out for Captain Claymore and the Joes. Will the Tomahawk arrive in time? All right, anchor the satellite and climb on board. We're out of here. Yo, Joe! Yo, Joe! Once again, G.I. Joe is victorious in their never-ending battle against Cobra and their minions. But they can never rest on their laurels, because Cobra can and will strike again, anytime and any place. Go, Joe!